I'm going to show you how to set up a new project folder and bring in a survey in Bentley Power Civil. I've set up an example project folder that I've called Practice. It's right here. Normally when you get a survey, it comes in your email from the surveyor. So you want to set up your folder with a CAD subfolder and then in it you'll want a folder for aerials, archive, PDF and survey. So in the survey folder bring in all the information you get from the surveyor and leave it with the original name that you got from the surveyor. So now we're going to want to open Power Civil. And now you're going to want to open up the survey. Here's our survey. We open it up. And now we'll want to save the survey as a Power Civil VAI EGN file. And I'm going to leave the same name, but just put survey in front of it. This way the original survey is preserved in the survey folder, and now we have a working copy to use for our drawing. One of the first things we're going to want to do is change the color table, because it comes with the AutoCAD color table. So we'll open and my computer automatically directs me to our color tables but they're in my computer osc documents and settings all users application data bentley power civil v8i workspace system data and we want to give it the color table called color and attach now we want to highlight the whole drawing Go up here to change element attributes and change everything to by level by color and then accept that. So now we want to set up the appearance of our drawings. So here we've got our contour line, it's a minor contour. Here's a major contour. So we're going to go to our level manager. In this drawing, the contours are on CTR, CTR index. CTR index is the major contour labels. We're going to want that to have a color of 14, a line type of 3, and a weight of 0. The minor contour in minor contours we're going to want to have color of 9 line type 2 and weight 0 and in this drawing we don't have property boundaries but if we did we would want them to come in at a full tone color whatever you choose for that we put them on the property line type and give them a line weight of 4. So that's now reflected in our drawing. So at this point we want to save and now we're ready to set up the models and sheets in the drawing.